students today we will understand chapter 17 effects of light module 1 in this module we will study about scattering of light students when sun rays pass through a glass prism what are the colors in the band of light on the other side of the prism if a beam of white light is passed through glass prism then it will split into seven colors these colors are red orange yellow green blue indigo and violet I repeat if a beam of white light is passed through glass prism then it will split into seven colors these colors are red orange yellow green blue indigo and violet students you have learned that light is composed of several colors you must have also seen that dust particles in beam of sunlight entering the house through a small window students we switch on the headlamps of a car when we drive through a thick for we see tiny particles floating in a beam we see a variety of shades of color in the early morning and evening sky in the photographs taken from space by satellites the earth appears to be bluish what is the cause of all these effects yes students that is scattering of light students scattering of light is the deviation of light rays from its straight path as light propagates through the atmosphere it travels in a straight path until it is obstructed by bits of dust or gas molecules i repeat scattering of light is the deviation of light rays from its straight path as light propagates through the atmosphere it travels in a straight path until it is obstructed by bits of dust or gas molecules students let us do one activity for that we need the following apparatus glass beaker diode laser or we also say laser pointer milk or milk powder dropper and a spoon students first step is take clear water in a glass beaker pass a beam of laser rays through it check whether the beam is seen in the water now use the dropper to add a few drops of milk to the water and stir 
the water will be seen to have become slightly turbid. Now pass the laser beam into it again. Students, a light beam will show the existence of light rays. A light beam is not seen in plain water. But it is clearly seen in slightly turbid water. Students, the light rays hit the tiny particles of milk and get scattered. If these scattered rays enter our eyes, we perceive the light. I repeat, a light beam is not seen in plain water but is clearly seen in slightly turbid water. The light rays hit the tiny particles of milk and get scattered. If these scattered rays enter our eyes, we perceive the light. Students, when the sun rises, our surrounding appear illuminated. The entire sky appears bright. This happens because of the dust and other tiny particles in the air. This is the scattering of sunlight by the tiny particles of the various constituents of air. Students, had there been no atmosphere on earth, the sky would have appeared dark during the day and of course the sun would be directly seen. This has been verified by observations from the rockets and satellites which go out of the Earth's atmosphere. Now students, let us do one more activity for the scattering of light. For this we require the various apparatus I show here. A table lamp with a 60 or 100 watt milky bulb, thin black paper, sticking tape, a packing needle, 100 or 200 ml glass beaker, milk or milk powder, dropper, spoon, etc. Students, first step is cover the mount of lampshade properly with black paper using sticky tape. Now, break a hole of 1 to 2 millimeter of diameter in the center of the paper with the help of the packing needle. Now take clear water in the beaker. Light the bulb and place the beaker in contact with the hole. Observe from the front and at an angle of 90 degree. Now add 2 to 
three drops of milk to the water and stir. Now observe again. Students, a few more drops of milk may have to be added to make the water dirty. Now, a blue tinge is seen when observed along 90 degree angle. This is the scattered blue light. Because the blue light is scattered, a red yellow light is seen from the front and the whole appears reddish. So that is what we can see through this experiment that as the blue light is scattered a red yellow light is seen from the front and the whole appears reddish. Students, sunlight is scattered by the molecules of gases like nitrogen, oxygen in the atmosphere. The blue color in the sunlight is scattered the most and therefore the sky appears blue. Sunlight reaches us through the layer of the atmosphere. I repeat, sunlight reaches us through the layer of the atmosphere. At sunset, the light reaching us travels a greater distance through the atmosphere. I repeat, at sunset, the light reaching us travels a greater distance through the atmosphere. Students, due to the greater distance, there is more scattering of the blue color. I repeat, due to the greater distance, there is more scattering of the blue color. As a result, the reddish yellow light reaches us directly and the sun appears red. I repeat, as a result, the red yellow light reaches us directly and the sun appears red. Students, let us see now examples and applications of scattering of light. The color of clear sky is blue because of because the blue color of white light spectrum is scattered most. The color of sky is in space is black because of absence of air in space due to which there is no scattering of light. Water in lakes and oceans looks blue because blue color is most scattered by the water molecules. Danger signals are red because red color has maximum wavelength and is least scattered. I repeat, the color of clear sky is blue because the blue color of white light spectrum is scattered most. The color of sky in space is black because of absence of air in space due to which there is no scattering of light. Water in lakes and oceans looks blue because blue color is most scattered by the water molecules. Danger signals 
are red because red color has maximum wavelength and is least scattered. Now let us see poems to remember. Students, a beam, a light beam is not seen in plain water but is clearly seen in slightly turbid water. Sunlight is scattered by the more molecules of gases like nitrogen, oxygen in the atmosphere. Red light is scattered less than blue light. Students, scattering of light is a phenomena in which light rays get deviated from its straight path on striking an obstacle like dust or gas molecules, water vapors, etc. I repeat, a light beam is not seen in plain water but is clearly seen in slightly turbid water. Sunlight is scattered by the molecules of gases like nitrogen, oxygen in the atmosphere. Red light is scattered less than blue light. Scattering of light is the phenomena in which light rays get deviated from its straight path on striking an obstacle like dust or gas molecules, water vapors, etc. There is a short homework for you. What is meant by scattering of light? Write a science-based paragraph on what if the sun did not rise and why do sky appear blue in color. I repeat what is meant by scattering of light. Write a science-based paragraph on what if the sun did not rise. Why do sky appear blue in color? Thank you.